All right, so I'm at uh, Zach and Kelly's house. Uh, we have an attic system that we're going to be replacing. Um, access it um, in the laundry. We do have pull down stairs, uh, nice big open. So yeah, great, great access. We do have walk boards. The height in here, once you get in here, it's, you know, right at that um, five feet. Um, and there is, you can see behind me, we've got lighting. Probably wouldn't hurt to, you know, bring some lighting for where the equipment is. Once we get up here, we're probably about, I don't know, about 10 feet away. You can see we're set up for an 80% efficient furnace. You can see that five inch flea that's going straight out through the roof. And supply on the left side, return on the right side. That condensation drain, I can actually see it. It's, it's basically coming from the unit and drops down in front of me. There's a, a, a drain, um, pretty much right. I'll show you when I get off the ladder. So probably might be able to rerun that. I'm just gonna look inside the closet and see if we, I can see that drain coming down. But uh, yeah, pretty good access. Uh, the line set we'll reuse um, and then we'll connect off that B vent, five inch flue coming down, come back with a uh, b with furnace. We will need a new safety pan. Let's get up a bit closer. Yeah, kind of a bit of a hodgepodge. You can see how this coil is like, like a different size and yeah. So I'm gonna try and get a measure, get a big pan we can put underneath everything from the return back to where the supply trunks are. Um, that's it. Uh, probably wouldn't hurt to bring a couple of extra walk boards, especially, you know, just getting around on the other side to work. You can sign a look, I'll show you from the reverse angle the access to get in. That's it.